Okay, this is a Times article. Um, it comes from the Time for Kids article and magazine. And this first article has to do with social distancing. We have heard many people um, in the past few weeks talking about social distancing and why it is so important to have social distancing during a pandemic. But why is that really important? And why do our leaders keep saying we need to maintain social distancing? And what does that mean? Social distancing means that you avoid mass gatherings, okay? Meaning you do not need to have groups of 250, 300, 400 people, or even groups of 50. Um, standing six feet apart from one another, people can spread the virus through coughs and sneezing. When you have social distancing, that takes away the, the risk of people coughing and infecting many different people. An infectious disease doctor from Canada said that social distancing is a very general term. There are different things that you can do that, that basically mean social distancing. For kids, learning from school, for learning from home instead of going to school, that really limits the amount of people they come into contact with. Social distancing is in response to the idea that many people can't stay home all the time, even during a disease outbreak. People have lives that they need to continue. By keeping space between themselves and others, you can reduce the likelihood from the virus being transferred. That is what it means when they say flattening the curve. So you can still go out, but if you stay away from many people and you limit how much you go out, then that can also help flatten the curve. It can be difficult to stay away from people, but in, when we think about how you can um, prevent people from becoming sick, I think it is worth it. Um, other things is say, Stay away from buses, trains, elevators. Only go into the grocery store once a day or once a week. That means you are listening. You are um, lessening the amount of time that you are around people. I hope this article was informative and thank you for watching.